that's the one. Okay, so we want to assess prices here, and then we're going to see, if there, if anything, what we can sell here. I mean, on the mainland, right? Uh, none of these are on um, the current land. Okay, so the only thing I can think of is if I go down here and purchase their silver, I can sell it up at Tamir for about twice the amount of money that I paid for, which is pretty good. So we'll probably do that after we finish this quest off, of course. So I want some more volunteers, and then I will... What do you mean I'm still working on? I have it! I have all of the grain that you asked for, didn't I? Oh, I probably ate one. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, let's head on to Kalachair, buy some more grain, then we'll head back up. I, I it, it'll, it'll be nighttime, but that's okay. I feel like that's fine. Because uh, I remember they had quite a bit of grain, didn't they? Oh, no, well, okay, well, they, they had the shortage of bread up north, right? So we'll go up the, back to um, Eyleach and sell them our bread, right? And then we'll go down to... Er, and then we'll go over here. Hopefully they have at least one pack of grain, because that's all we need, I believe, right? Uh, we need... Yeah, we just need one pack of grain. They have more than one. Okay, this bread is actually not worth much more up here. So I don't know what they're talking about with that whole shortage thing, but whatever. We, we, we probably made, like, two shillings off of that. Maybe, maybe a little bit more. So, so far the only thing that's really viable is trading, um... Uh, is trading the silver so far. Yes, yeah, save to you from hunger. That's awesome. Um, I guess it is, because I would like my, my village to be, like, as well off as possible, because that way they can pay me more taxes. And all that. Um... So you can increase your charisma. I don't know how you got your trade that high, but I'm going to increase your charisma until it's even better. I guess we'll give him entertainment and such until he can get better trade. It'll be a while until he can increase his trade skill. You, I need to increase your strength, because you're not nearly good enough at fighting yet. Um, I'll increase your throne too. And let me see your equipment. I want to take your sword and give you mine. Because mine is not that good. I mean, it's it's thrust is awesome, but I'm I'm not gonna I feel like I'm gonna be slashing more than thrusting, and I can block with this sword, which is something you can't do with the other one. Oh, hmm, he can use the horse. I'm not gonna give him the horse. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I'm not gonna give him the horse, but he can use it. Um, because it's you know a lordly thing. Well, this is the last town we haven't been to yet, I believe. Well, I haven't assessed prices at a lot of towns actually, so I'm gonna go down here. We'll once we get here, it'll probably be maybe noon. So we'll have plenty of time to assess prices, perform music and such, and then... Let's do the music now. Um, and then, after that, we will sleep here. <coughs> and hopefully we'll have some, like, good trade goods that we can use. To, like, make some advance money without leaving the island. Because that's my goal. I just want to get a solid trade route going without leaving this island. And none of these cities are on the mainland. That That's a lot of money, though, for hide. I'm, I'm not going to go that far, because it probably won't even be worth it. Leatherworks are a little bit cheaper here. Stone. What the heck? Okay. Yeah, my screen. Oh my god, my screen keeps getting dark. Oh, because my power thing is disconnecting. Well, that's kind of unfortunate. Okay, smoked fish is kind of expensive here. Flax is. Flax is worth a. It's a lot here. And wool is a lot here. Okay, so we're gonna go actually. Because. I recall Clotch Air produced wool, right? So we're gonna. Actually, we're gonna sleep here. But then we're gonna go up to Clotch Air, purchase all their wool, and sell it here. Because that seems like it'll get fetch us a fair amount of money per piece, right? It's about 240 there to buy, and it's about 300 something here. So I feel like perhaps, oh, whoops, I don't think we rested for long enough. Um, perhaps that we will be able to um, make a significant profit doing this. Because right now, I'm kind of at a loss of how to make money. We're not at war with anybody, so it's very difficult, honestly, to make money in large amounts without fighting bandits or doing what I'm doing right now. It's goods. We're going to purchase the wool cloth, because it is a lot cheaper here. These leatherworks, I believe, are a lot more, so we're not going to buy them. Flax bundles? No thanks. Okay. Cheese is a lot. Um, so if I find cheap cheese somewhere, I'll, we all know that I can sell it a clutch air. So, Krugen? Or Krugen? Oh, god. Don't, don't start doing that. Right, so yes, it, it is worth a lot more here. They didn't have much wool, unfortunately. I'm going to sell them that spear, too. Um, let's see, what are the prices? So, I believe cabbage is cheaper here. 55 for... I don't know what that is. I believe stone is more expensive here. Flax bundles a lot here, actually. I probably could have brought, brought the flax bundles over as well. But I think I'll go back, buy flax bundles, and see how that fares at Kruigan. Um Hopefully it'll do well. 
The squall of his town is all but deserted. That's mighty unfortunate for you guys. Isn't it? Okay. So right then. At any rate, let's head over here. Let's go purchase the flax. Oh no, that's just as much. Okay. Let's see, leather works. Um, tools seem to be pretty cheap. So I'm going to buy one of these tools for 300 and then we're going to head down to Tamer and just see what we can do from here. Hopefully it doesn't become like dusk, or not dusk, um, midnight before we get here. Uh, let's, let's eat them. They're really tasty. Alright, I should give them to my troops. I guess for future reference, I now know. Forcini, or Forcini, however you pronounce that. Okay, bro. Let's get them. You want to mess with me? Um, where are they? Well, let's let's get up on the walls. We'll we'll probably be able to see them from up on the walls, won't we? That makes sense. Uh huh. Hmm. Oh, I see them. Presumably Osmond will help us. I mean, I don't see why he wouldn't, but, I mean, that's, a, that's kind of the whole point of having a bodyguard, isn't it? We're lord and such. He can't just attack me like this. Without death. Death. Okay, I missed. Death. Damn it. Shit, 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 shit. Fight him! Thank you. Guess he heard me. I'm not going to use my javelins anymore because I don't want to get hit. If I get hit, then I'm probably going to die, right? God, my one-hand weapon skill sucks. <laughs> I think that's all of them. Perhaps there's three. I don't know where the third one is, but... Oh, well, Osmond figured it out. It seems. Yeah, I found him. I don't want to get hit by any of those javelins, that's for sure. Yeah, you, you fight him, bro. We talk right right now. Okay. Yeah, you don't want to fight two people with swords, do ya? We're very lordly. Me and my bodyguard friend. Oh, really? Ah, I can't believe I did that. I just let down my guard. Hopefully, hopefully they didn't take anything except for money. No. Okay. Well, I guess that could have been worse then. Right. So. Let's do some music. Oh, whoops, I probably shouldn't have done it. I probably should have just... Because now it's midnight. Mm. Hopefully we'll still be able to rest. I don't know if, if it'll let us rest, actually. Got some more renown. I, I do like how being a bard gets you renown, though. Because this way I, I have like a nice, safe way. Let's see. There's apparently a lot of money at Tamer. So we're going to go get it. Nope. Apparently we're not. Maybe if I leave the town and come back again. Because maybe it has to like load when I go into the town, right? So, nope. Whatever. I'd like to have cavalry, but I don't really have the money for it, so. Okay, tools are more here. Not much more, but they are more. Wool cloth. Flax bundles are super cheap here. So we're going to buy these flax bundles, and we're going to sell them up at, um... Actually, it doesn't matter where we sell them, I don't think. Uh, we can we can choose either Clotair or um, Kruigan. So we're just going to go up to Clotair, right here, and then we're going to buy their wool cloth and their, um, yeah, just their, their wool cloth if they have any. So we want to go here, we want to purchase your wool cloth. You don't have any. Luckily, we're going to make a bunch of money off of those flax bundles, so that's definitely a good thing. This meat seems to be a lot here. I don't recall if we had meat or beer down, down, um, south where we were in Tamer. I don't recall which one it was, so therefore I can't obviously say whether or not it would be beneficial to... No, I don't, I don't, actually, I don't really want more troops at this point. I Because I, I already have too many. Because they're... They hate me, and they cost too much money. <laughs> it's a bad situation, I believe they would call it. Um, yeah, we're going to owe them money, I believe. Earlier wealth, earlier cash. Oh, right, because we are almost out of money in the, um, the treasury. Right, actually, I'm going to go fight bandits, because... I don't think we're going to be able to make enough money, to be honest. Not like this. 
or perhaps we'll go we'll we'll go down here, right? Because this this was also close to the um. No, uh, yeah, sure. Why the hell not? <laughs> At least I got morale, you know. I wonder what happens if you choose to go yourself. 